Hello, my name is Stephen Lake. I'm the director of Drive for Freedom. Um, I wanted to make a, a video to show the world what uh, the film is about. And I thought it'd be easier to show you what it isn't about rather than what it actually is about, um, for starters. maybe use a facility such as uh, factoring or invoice finance then where's the money where's the money that's not the question where's the money the question you should be asking Stephen is what is this film about now, it's not about the banking crisis is it no nope. no it's no. not is it no nope. right no, so no, no. why don't you go you've embarrassed yourself goodbye bye is that the giant oh. um can I have a, a hamburger meal please uh, what size is what size is, is there? I think I'm gonna have to go with regular. I don't think this is a film about burgers. <laughs> this film isn't shot on IMAX. Ex excuse me, sir. The uh, the people would like to know what you think that this film is about. Uh, guns, George Bush, uh, education, famine. Homeless. It's not about any of those things. Cats are made to play, but they do have an enemy. Yet, in the harshest relationship on earth, love finds a way. This is not a film about fluffy little animals. This is a film about clotheslines. There is a growing environmental movement urging Americans to ditch their dryers and embrace clotheslines, but not everyone wants to see laundry once again flapping in the wind. They can't take their laundry and hang it out on the line anymore. And that's happening all over America. Rules prohibit me from hanging my laundry outside. If you didn't have the association, people would be free to do what they want. That was an argument. A life was lost because of clothes hanging outside. Just shut him down in cold blood. Over a clothes land. In America, we have evolved in a, to a, a state where we like things to be a, a certain way. If the lower income people around the globe follow our bad example, the whole planet is driven towards a disaster. But if you visit a retail shop today, in a high-end retail shop, you will find them stocking dryers. So naturally, the demand for all these products increases. To dry your clothes, so many kilograms of coal are being burned. Well, the United States uses 25% of the world's energy, and we have 4% of the world's population. They'll just have to pry the clothespins out of my cold, dead hands. So this is a tool of freedom, and I'm not going to let it go. Okay, so that should give you a good idea of what the film is and isn't about, but we need your help to finish it. We've completed filming, we've completed editing. The problem is that we can't release it or show it to anybody until we pay for things like archive, uh, the rights to use the music that we want, want to put in the film, um, a professional colour grade, a uh, professional sound mix. Go and visit dryingforfreedom.com, uh, take a look at what we're doing, and if, if you believe in, in, in the idea that we have here, then please, we, we could really use your help and your support so that we can get this film and this story and this idea out there. So thank you very much.